Yeah, working on a sprit for St. Jock and got a 12 inch long piece of wood we're trying to make into the sprit and uh, cutting it down. It's kind of like walking in during the middle of surgery. It doesn't look too good, but once you start getting pieces uh, cut off and shaved down and using the belt sander and router, you start getting something that's looking more like a spar like you want it to get it uh, smoothed out. So we're just slowly chipping away trying to find the inner sprit but somewhere along the line with this board has some kind of tension in it. It's just started crawling all over the place after it was glued up and right about in here started getting a pretty good uh, twist or something where it's wanting to bow out like this and we really don't want that so we could hack the rest of this wood away and have something that looked real nice once we got it all finished out but you can kind of see when we turn it, it it just drops down and wants to wants to bow out that direction you know it comes up high and then it drops down again right here in this middle part so we tried to trim some of it away see if we could balance it out and it's not going to work so what we're probably going to end up having is a end up, this will become photo candles we'll take this five or six foot hunk up here and salvage it cut it in the middle there take the hunk on the other end salvage it for something else and we're going to shift gears because that's like the third one we've tried using one method we're going to pull out this uh, four inch and a half square piece here and take the uh, 45s off each corner get it down to eight sided and start working with it there that's what we got planned for this today